If the high goes dies, I can't make them go to wait Cause you were born on the 4th of July Freedom ring was something on the surface It stinks, I said something on the surface Well it kinda makes me nervous So say that you deserve this And what kind of guy would serve this We will cure this dirty old disease Well if you got the poison I've got the remedy The remedy is the experience This is a dangerous liaison I said the comedy is that serious This is a strange enough new play on words I said the tragedy is how you're gonna spend the rest of your nights with the light on so shine the light on all of your friends when it all amounts to nothing in the end Hello, and welcome to episode three-ish of the Miss Mueller Show. I'm not here. Miss Money is your sub. Let's go over the warm-up. So, oopsie. Today, we're going to be talking more about protein structure affecting function and organism function um, by doing your CER disease project paragraph that's going to be due on block day. You can either submit it on paper or on Schoology if you'd prefer to type it. If... I get a sub report saying that everyone was working really, really hard and was using their time extremely wisely, but you need more time. I may be persuaded to give you an extra 20 to 30 minutes, and then you will turn it in during turn it in during class on block day. If not, you can bet your butt it will be due when you walk in the door. So make sure you are using your time wisely, my friends. So let's do our goals for the day, which are taped up on the board. So can a volunteer please choose to read it out loud for the rest of class year? Pause the video and do this now. Okay, so we are done reading the goals. Let's go over what we're gonna do today. So yesterday, everyone went through this possible genetic diseases and we all picked them, okay? We called dips. If you were not here, 
once I set, turn you loose, then I need you to call Miss Money over and tell her, hey, I need to pick this. And then just pick one, okay? Write it down because this is what you're gonna be studying for the next week or so while you do your final product. And I will give you more information about that when I return on Wednesday. So on page 77, you should have this bad boy, okay? You should have your genetic disorder written down if you were here yesterday and your name. So it's gonna be in a series of steps and I will show you some resources as we go. So the first thing you're to do is to do some research. You are to go to a specific website and you're gonna read the description, genetic changes, and about what that gene is associated with. So remember that a gene is just a segment of DNA that codes for a protein. So here's an example. So this is a disorder, um, Rabson-Mendel-Hall syndrome. So the description is gonna be number one, so I just want you to read it, tell me like, what is it? Okay, tell me what it is. Then when you go down to genetic changes, you'll see a little bit about what causes it. So I see it results from mutation in the INSR gene, and then it's making protein uh, for an insulin receptor, blah, 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 read it. Then for number three, you're gonna click on this learn more about the gene associated, and you're gonna click on this gene. So some of you are gonna have more than one gene. Your job is to just pick one. So if you want to choose um, and shop around a bit for which gene you're gonna to wanna to do, cool, cool, but a lot of you, you just have one option. So you're gonna click on it, and it's gonna redirect you all to this gene, and you're gonna tell me about what protein it makes. In this case, it's an insulin receptor. Your job is to tell me what that means. So make sure that you're making sense of what you're reading. If you don't understand something, like you don't know what insulin is, look it up, okay? So that is step one. So step two is you are going to be doing some APA citation. So your APA with Lil John is gonna be extremely helpful to you. So if you look on Squalogy, right here under the unit four folder and under genetics disorder paragraph, I have that APA citation with Lil John and Eminem. So here is that video that I showed you way back when. And if you are not understanding what APA is, I highly suggest you watch it. This thing right here is the actual handout that I gave you, which is on page 29. So maybe take a peek at that. Um, so your job is to do some citing practice, okay? Figure it out. When you're done with that, you're gonna go to a stop sign, you're gonna call Miss Money over, say, hey, I'm done. Your job is to then CER that business. So again, on Schoology, right here, CER with Taylor Swift. You can see the video that's all about what CER is, and you can see the actual handout that we did. You should have it pasted on page 30 if you did it, which most of you did. So your job is to review that if need be, and you're going to practice using this paragraph that I wrote about adrenoleukodystrophy, which is what we looked at on Friday. So your job is to identify the claim, evidence, and reasoning using color or some sort of color coding so that way I know that you know what claim evidence and reasoning is in this paragraph. Miss Money has a key, so when you're ready, raise your hand, call her over, she'll check it, make sure it's right, give you some feedback, and you can move on. Next thing, you are to CER what you learned in step one. So how does DNA cause the symptoms of your disorder? So using what you research, you're gonna make a claim. So how does DNA cause your disease? Maybe look at this bad boy as an example then you're going to have to extract some evidence and remember it needs to be cited so look at station or step two then give some reasoning if you're going to be thorough it needs to be more than just one two three sentences okay mine up here was probably like five or six i expect probably five or six sentences y'all can do that then once you're done with this call miss money over she'll check and give some feedback and then write it into a dang paragraph if you did a great job all you need to do is just put this in paragraph format okay add some punctuation add some transition, make it sound good. Then either staple this thing and turn it into the basket or you can do it on Schoology, your choice. Either way, I must need, I require this half sheet of paper in the basket. So let's talk about some resources that are online. So you can see my face now. So over here, and I know I showed you this yesterday, but just so we're clear, right here, right here. 
right here, I have a list of diseases. You don't know how to spell yours? Boom. It's right there. It's also on Schoology, but it's also right here. Next, APA. Boom. You don't know how to do step two? Do it. Scan it. Get it done. Also, page 29 is also where you're going to find what we did last semester. Moving on. This is harder than it looks, friends. CER. Step three. Watch video. If you do not know, do it. Get it done. Page 30 is where we actually did the Taylor Swift thing. You probably have it. Look at it. So I expect that everyone's going to be working independently. Okay. I understand that some people are doing the same thing. You are to sit in your assigned seats and you are to work quietly. If you're period one, you also have some things to finish here for your protein synthesis assessment. It should be silent. People in period one, do you remember when I was gone for a sub and I had people talking to the assessment? I threw everyone's assessment away. I will throw yours away. I will. So everyone needs to be working quietly. Okay. Listen to some music. Okay. If Miss Money thinks that you're not doing stuff, then music goes away. Get stuff done because your grade will thank you. Let's start the semester right, friends. Okay. We have only a couple grades in the grade book. Let's all start off well, okay? I'll be here on block day to answer any questions, and y'all have my phone number, okay? Text me on Remind or over email. Just get it done, okay? Make me proud, friends. I'm going to miss you. I'll probably be texting some of you just saying, like, hey, what's up? How are things going? And I expect your best behavior and be treating Miss Money with the respect that she deserves. So I think that's about it. Okay, love you. Bye.